so this video is going to be showing y'all how I fill in my eyebrows using my bougie cream powder okay so this is the angle brush that I use to fill in my eyebrows this is my bougie cream powder and my bougie concealer that I'm gonna use to outline the bottom of my eyebrows to give it more um, definition all right so here I go I start from the outer brow and I just lightly fill in what I already have um, my eyebrow don't come all the way out to my nose bone structure so I bring it a little closer because that's what I want and then I just go ahead and lightly fill that in and you see how that just comes together sometimes I stand back to check the balance of both of my eyebrows because sometimes when you up close in the mirror you can't like really see what you see when you step back from the mirror okay so um if you want it to be more um coverage you want it to be darker you just um apply some more brow powder on your pen on your brush um, I love brow powder versus a pencil or other so if you desire to have more coverage you just go ahead and you put some more um, brow powder on the brush so what I was saying um, if you the reason the difference between a brow powder and a pencil is that a brow powder or brow cream it gives you more of that natural brow look it doesn't look fake it doesn't look made up it don't look penciled in give you that nice light look natural look versus a pencil when you apply a pencil on your eyebrows it looks more heavier oily it has this shiny look to it as you can see looking at my eyebrow even though i have liquid foundation on with um on top of the liquid foundation i had put on some pressed powder but you can't even tell like it's not even a you know messing with the brow powder the brow, brow cream so now what i'm getting ready to do is get my spoolie all right so um, now that I'm going to have my spoolie, I'm going to just lightly brush out that line. You want that to look natural and fine and you just want it to look very blended into your skin. Okay, so now I'm getting ready to use my flat brush, which is a concealer brush that I use to put my concealer on underneath the eyebrow so I'm just going to outline it and I'm just going to use very little and I use the flat part of the brush Close the door. Close the door. So they don't have to have that all in my video. Alright, so as you can see, you can see the def the definition is more bolder, is more defined. You can see the difference from it not being contoured or outlined, highlighted.
And you always keep in mind, like if you, when you was filling in your eyebrow and you end up going too high or too low or too wide or, you know, it's okay because when you go in with your concealer and you start outlining, the concealer and the brush can act as an eraser and remove any imperfections of your eyebrow work. So in the beginning, I ain't gonna lie, it's gonna take some time to pick your speed up, to have the eye for your eyebrows. And I don't normally do the top. I just take, I don't dip back into this concealer because I don't wanna have like that, I'm trying to blend the line out at the top. So yeah, <laughs> so that's it. Today I'm not doing too much um, with the makeup today. I'm just going for a super natural look, which I'm always rocking a natural look. I'm never overdone. Even when I'm going out for a special event, I'm never overdone. The most that I may do to make my look look overdone is probably add some eyeshadow. Because I don't... <laughs> I'm not a big fan of eyeshadow like that. I used to be crazy. I used to rock like four, three different colors on my eyes. And now I'm to the point to where I just wear one or none. Don't care. No. Do what rocks your boat and not what rocks everybody else's. So. Um. That's it. So now I'm getting ready to apply my bougie mink lashes. Check out. <laughs> Sorry. Check out my next video. Make sure that you drop your comments below my YouTube channel after watching this video. Give me thumbs up. Give You know, I don't want no thumbs down. But if you don't like it, hey, that's your opinion. But most definitely, please, please, please leave your reviews. Leave those comments down below this video and give this thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel and make sure to hit the notification bell so that you could be notified when I have uploaded more videos. But make sure you check out how to apply your script lashes. Bye.